Hello again everyone, welcome back to a new video. This episode is for all the PS4 users who are struggling to connect an external hard drive to their gaming console. Many of us use external drives to store our favourite PS4 games, so it's no surprise that it's very frustrating when the console fails to recognise that the hard drive is even there. Now, if you're stuck in a similar situation, don't panic as there are several methods to fix this problem. Whether your PS4 isn't recognising a USB hard drive from the very beginning, or one that suddenly stopped working out of nowhere, in this video we're going to go through the different solutions to fix this problem. But before we get started, make sure you've subscribed to the channel so you don't miss any future content. Firstly, we'll discuss how to fix your hard drive if it's not been recognised by your PS4 since the day you bought it. So here are some solutions to help fix that problem. Firstly, fire up a PC or a laptop and try connecting your hard drive to it. In the case that even your PC doesn't recognise the hard drive, it's quite possible that it's either damaged or it contains malware. So first try running an antivirus program to scan and remove any viruses from the hard drive. You should then look for signs of physical damage on the hard drive. Though it is quite uncommon for new hard drives to be physically damaged, it's always a good strategy to do a thorough check, and in the case that the hard drive is damaged, reach out to the seller and ask them to replace the unit. It's also worth noting, PS4s do not support wireless connections with external USB drives, so make sure you're using an appropriate connection type. It's also a possibility that the USB port on your PS4 that you're trying to connect the hard drive to is either broken or damaged. If that's the case, switch to a different port and see if the PS4 then recognises the hard drive or not. And in the event that your console is still unable to recognise a hard drive, the last step would be to update your PS4 software to the latest version. Outdated system software can cause many different types of errors and a PS4 not recognising a hard drive happens to be one of them. So make sure that you've installed the latest software updates on your PS4. The second situation is if your PS4 stops recognising a hard drive that was previously working. This usually happens if there's something wrong with the console itself, however, just to be on the safe side, try connecting the hard drive to a PC and see if that recognises it or not. If it does recognise it, you can then proceed towards troubleshooting the PS4 itself. Now the easiest way to fix a PS4 is to rebuild the database. If you don't already know, rebuilding the database will clean the fragments of your PS4's internal drive and help speed up its performance, but as a result, you should hopefully not face any more issues connecting your external hard drive. So here is how to rebuild the database on a PS4 console. Start by turning off your PS4, then tap and hold the power button until you hear two consecutive beeps. There's usually around seven seconds for these beeps to appear. Now your PS4 will automatically boot in safe mode. Connect your controller directly to the console because you're gonna need it to navigate through the menus in safe mode. Then using the controller, select rebuild database from the list. To do this, select option 5 and tap X on the controller to initiate the database rebuilding process. Now this process will take a few hours to complete, during which time the screen will go black from time to time. During this process, it's very important you do not turn off the console at all or you may end up with some data loss. Finally, when the process completes, your PS4 will restart automatically. Now connect the hard drive and see if it recognizes it or not. If your PS4 still doesn't recognize the external hard drive, the next way to fix the issue would be to initialize it again. Initializing a PS4 will reinstall your system software from scratch, so you shouldn't encounter any errors in the future. However, it also wipes all of your files. So make sure you've backed up any and all PS4 data before you proceed any further. Then follow these steps to initialize your PS4. Firstly, power off your console and again follow the same steps to boot in safe mode. Connect your controller directly to the console and tap the PS button. Now, using the controller, select option 7, initialize PS4. 
Once a console gets initialized, make sure you update the system software to the latest version. Then finally, you can connect your external drive to the console and it should get automatically recognized. After you fix the error though, it's possible you may have some lost files from the hard drive. If this happens, you'll need a data recovery tool to get your files back and we'd recommend using Wondershare Recoverit. Wondershare Recoverit is a professional data recovery program that will help you retrieve lost and deleted files from different storage devices. The tool supports multiple file formats, which means you'll be able to recover videos, images, and even PS4 games. So here is how you can use Wondershare Recoverit to recover lost files from an external hard drive. Install and launch Recoverit on your PC, then connect the hard drive to your computer and wait for the PC to recognize it. Then select the hard drive as the location that you want Recoverit to scan. It'll be listed under the External Devices tab. Then click Start and Recoverit will start scanning the hard drive to find all deleted files. This will take a couple of minutes though, depending on the size of the hard drive. After the scanning process completes, you'll see a list of all your deleted files on the screen and you can select which files you want to retrieve, then click recover and save them to the PC. You can also tap the preview button to see a preview of each file before you choose to recover it or not. So that is how you can fix a PS4 not recognizing an external hard drive. If you found this video helpful, make sure to drop a like and leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you can see more videos like this in the future.